This week I got to play Dead of Winter, a co-op survival game where the group has to complete the main objective as well as their own secret objectives. The secret objectives could be anything from building barricades to having a person of your in a certain location or having a certain type of card in your hand. However, some of the secret objectives are betrayers and while they have varying objectives as well, their primary aim is to make the group lose. Fortunately, we didn't have any of those in our game and it's just as lucky because it went south pretty fast. Our game started off pretty well with an abundance of food. There was not much trash in the game and we were doing pretty well. But after a number of our survivors died, we started losing morale very quickly. And at several points in the game, it looked like we could have lost, but we managed to hold on in there. A few of the people I was playing with, including myself, were fairly new to the game, so it took a little while to sit up and explain the rules. But we all understood it fairly easily and it worked quite well. And not only did we win, I also managed to complete my secret objective. Luckily we had no betrayers in our game, otherwise it would have made things a lot more difficult. I have been wanting to play this game for a little while and for the last two weeks it has been played on the tables next to me. And I was so happy on Tuesday night to finally get a group to play it with. It is a great concept with a whole host of different possibilities. I first saw Dead of Winter on Will Wheaton's tabletop. I really liked it, I wanted to play it, and I just really enjoyed playing with it. If you've played it, let me know what your thoughts are. Thank you for watching. My name's James Howard. I'll see you again real soon.